this is uh, the third time in just this year that an execution has taken exceedingly long, uh, where the inmate was moving, clearly not uh, thoroughly unconscious, not the way the state had planned it. I think this is going to require some intervention, some national review of, of what's going on so that this doesn't keep happening. I think the state is going to have to be more forthcoming uh, to defend what they're doing. Uh, the, the assumption that they're going to get it right is long past. Three in a row, especially with this drug, midazolam, that they used, or any other new drug that hasn't been used. I mean, that's part of the problem. This is an experiment, and it's not going well. This is a turning point. I, I think um, so many people are, are, people are hearing about this. This, is, this definitely doesn't always break through to the national consciousness on, on each execution. But now it has three times in a row in, in a few months. And there's been other stories. So uh, we're at a tipping point. We'll see what happens. Um, but clearly some change is, is, is in the offing.